Hey, what's going on, everybody? New to the YouTube channel world here, but not new to the bodybuilding world. I'm 47. Uh, don't quite have the physique I used to have, but very much still into the sport. Um, I thought I'd start out with my first video with some of my favorite bodybuilders. Uh, Flex Wheeler probably being my number one guy. Of course, Ronnie Coleman's a you know, freak of nature. Um, anybody that saw this show knows that Ronnie won, although I thought my boy Flex should have won this one. Um, Flex, I don't really think he was really ever the same after his accident in 94. I think prior to that, he probably was, I don't know, he had some edge to his physique that just didn't, I don't know, that I don't just think anybody else really had. Uh, I don't know, maybe I'm biased because he's my favorite, but um, uh, I'm going to move on and, and show some other ones. Oh, yeah, I really don't like seeing that. All right, so let's move on here to some others okay live not moving on to others a little bit more flex before we move on really not much to say here other than oh my god freak of nature roly without a doubt another one of my favorites i mean he looks pretty good here but if he can get his diet perfect there's nothing that's going to stop this guy absolutely magnificent physique now i know a lot of people said that Hadi should have won this and I completely disagree. I think without a doubt, he's number two. No doubt about it. But Brandon Curry, man, is not getting the respect that he deserves. Uh, I mean, I know this double bye is just one of the poses, but I, I just don't see how Hadi is beating Curry right there. Okay, so now here, the 2017 San Marino Pro, they give this to McMillan over Hadi. I just don't get it. He, Hadi's diet is definitely better than McMillan on this day and they give it to the bigger guy sometimes a lot of times when he's not the better man he's just bigger and what the heck is going on with Hadi's lower ab Have you ever seen anybody with a better lower ab than upper abs insane all right so here's a guy William Bonex been finishing in the top like three or four or one or uh, two in, in most of the events that he's been going in and I mean no doubt he's an amazing bodybuilder and Always is on point with his diet, but I just genetically I just don't like him the way his Lats come off of of his obliques and from the abs to the obliques to the lats like it just I don't know It just doesn't look right and I, I don't understand how he's uh, placing over other guys I <laughs> Oh, 